Hey guys, it's Sandeep from Phone Arena on this day 75 of 2017 and you're watching Phone Arena Daily, your everyday fix of technology news. Let's get started. Coolpad announced a brand new smartphone in the Note series called the Note 5 Lite and it's essentially the same handset as the Conjure that was announced during CES 2017. So this smartphone comes with a 5-inch 720p display, has 16GB of internal memory along with 3GB of RAM and is powered by a MediaTek MT6735 processor. There's a hybrid dual SIM card slot on board along with cameras of resolution 13 megapixel at the back and 8 megapixel at the front with f2.2 aperture and there's a 2500mAh battery along with 4G LTE capabilities. The smartphone will be available exclusively from Amazon India in both gold and grey color starting from March 21st onwards and will be available through an open sale and not a flash sale. Sony has just announced a rupees 10,000 price card for the Xperia XZ smartphone which was a flagship of the year 2016 that they announced during IFA 2016. The smartphone was initially introduced at a price of Rs 51,990 and is now available at 41,990 although some websites have it listed even for Rs 39,990. In my opinion however the handset is still quite a bit overpriced and considering that the XZ Premium as well as the XZS is coming out pretty soon I would suggest waiting for that if you still want to get yourself a Sony device instead of going for the XZ itself. OnePlus is launching a brand new limited edition of the OnePlus 3T device in association with Colette which is a French designer that specializes in clothing as well as accessories and is based out of Paris. Users can actually purchase this device exclusively from the store in Paris on March 21st when they open its doors to celebrate the 20th anniversary of Colette. The device will be launched in a limited black edition and will have Colette branding on the back. It will come with 128GB of internal storage and will also have a unique box that comes in a blue color rather than the red and white colors of the usual OnePlus devices. Apart from that, we feel that the design looks really good and it looks really good in black edition but we feel that OnePlus should actually introduce this variant with the regular OnePlus 3T as well. Samsung has announced that it is planning to ramp up production for the 10nm FinFET process on which the Exynos 8895 processor is built. The Qualcomm Snapdragon 835 is also built on the same process and is being built in Samsung's own foundry. They also announced the 8nm and 6nm processors which will allow better scalability, power as well as performance advantages compared to the current processor nodes. Today's deal of the day is an offer on memory products such as hard disks, pen drives as well as memory cards that are available at a discounted price exclusively through a link in the description below from Amazon India. So that brings us to a point of today's discussion. What do you guys think about the limited edition OnePlus 3T that they have brought out in association with Colette? Do you like the color of full black and do you think that it would be something that you would look forward to buying when it comes on the OnePlus 3T? Not when, if it comes on the OnePlus 3T. That's it for today guys. See you again tomorrow with more technological news.